Hello everyone and welcome back to Troubleshooter. Let me check if I'm recording. Yes, I am. So, I've been playing around. I didn't have much time because those episodes, the past four, I think, four or at least four that you're watching, I am recording this everything in a big batch because I'm going on my summer holidays and I wanted the timetable to be the same as it always is, so I recorded big batches of everything. But that unfortunately means I did not have time to farm. I did do um, a mission or two uh, behind the scenes, I mean off camera. I did create a second drone. I want to start experimenting with the drones um, as well with Kylie. I don't think I changed much in the rosters didn't get any good items, I don't think so, but I actually um, sat down to the notepad and created... Ooh. But speed is down and vigor is down. I don't need that. Well, the ESP power is basically healing power because it comes into the equation, but it's not that much of a difference. 79. So yeah, I sat down to the notepad and started theory crafting a build or two and I kind of know what I want to do. I especially sat down to Kylie because Kylie is in a very bad state right now in my team and I think she is actually a very good character when I started looking at different mastery types and different abilities she has and what we can do with her. She isn't a bad character, I just didn't have the means to build her properly. Oh, I'm gonna change this. I got that in the last mission and it has the machine attacking proper probability probability um, capability. And also one thing about that. I did try the... I'm gonna show it to you. The mission... The 54 mission. And it had, I'm guessing it's the ones that Gact was talking about. The bots. Dang, those bots. Those new bots. They pack a punch. They do pack a punch. I have to admit, that's that's pretty awesome. Um, maybe you see them because Gact said they're in the 50 mission. I didn't expect them in the 54 because I didn't have that mission before. And... well, yeah. I'm expecting if they're in two side missions, they have to be in a um, in a normal scenario mission, in a normal story mission. They just have to, because I don't believe they gave us a enemy that they wouldn't use in a story to present it to everyone. Nope, do not believe it. I actually want to change the acceleration propeller as well. Um, I used it at first, but now when we have a lot of more room in the mission in the missions themselves and our other characters are built up properly, I find myself not using it that much. So, yeah. Can we have anything else that's useful? Um, how about a I don't have it? Weird. I was thinking about an upgraded ice grenade. Cause well I'm not gonna not gonna go craft it now. Do it off screen. Because I don't know if I can actually do this mission. Changing from easy to hard, because easy is grinding difficulty. Got it? Got it. So yeah, not farming this time. We're doing stuff. So I don't ex if this is a the last mission and the previous story segment suggested that this is kind of last mission. So you know, I don't know if we're gonna do it the first time we tackle it. Because like I said, I didn't have time to build up properly the builds that I have in my notepad right now. I'll see, I have, I actually have at least two ideas for Alyssa. 
Dang, it it kind of fits Hansen. It kind of fits Hansen. This look, not gonna lie. Hmm. I'm gonna continue my thought after we get the story segment, just so you know. Front armor duchy farmer. Well, what were you growing there, my man? Was it wheat? Was it corn? What was it? Good for the aristocrats then. Good for them. Go and fight your own wars. Let me just check something. Yeah, the power supply is properly plugged in and I'm properly recording it seems. Got it. Good for them. Hmm. Well, I can imagine that. They choose to seek a maybe new meaning of life and a new start, who knows? Hmm. Well, they asked, you say. But as we know, they actually came to be shunned by the citizens, the native citizens, but, you know, that, that's how it was in history and that's how it is now. Well, yeah, of course he did. Small self-employed farm farmer, you say, Hansen? Of course they do. And they're not gonna give their money to them. The, their, I mean the aristocrat, the governing body. Oh. Well, Hansen's quite fair when it comes to law, it seems. The, in this... I mean, he is doing criminal activity, but he does it... It is gonna sound strange, but he does it by the book. I mean, he is a proper manager, even if it's crime involved, so... Yeah. He does, he does try, you know, he does try. I don't know, Hanson. Sounds... Sounds good, but it doesn't work, I don't think so. Yeah, well, no one wants the war to go for a long time. That you go into the army, son. Well, yeah, doesn't work like that every time, my man. Doesn't work like that. Don't. Did you just... <laughs> okay, okay. Well... He's gonna have his turn then. <coughs> and I'm afraid this time none of you volunteered. It's kind of a, you know, compulsory volunteering scenario, you know? Okay. Danson, Hansen. What is this village? In Sweden or something? Yeah, they're taking it all. I'm afraid, in the face of war, no it's not. And that's nothing, not nothing out of the ordinary, it actually does work like that. The same goes for um, off-terrain vehicles, um, with 4-on-4, four four, um, how do you say it in English? Um... Oh god, uh, not transmission, you know what I'm talking about, I just can't find the word today. Because um, I am recording this actually very, very early in the morning, just finished my coffee. Because I need to actually step this up and finish it, because uh, in tomorrow I'm going, I'm going on my holidays. What is this? It's about 8 on the 28th. 
So, yeah. My man, the world is wrong. That's that's what doesn't make sense. Well, you can complain. You can complain. Yeah, man. Um. Yep. Yep. The man has the, has a look on his face like he he did this whole scene for the whole village. That this is the, his tenth hour of doing this shit. <laughs> he kind of looks like that. Uh. Yep. Not much of an explainer since you've been silent the whole time Hanson was talking to you. So. Yeah, it actually works like that. Yep. Well, depending on what you have in constitution, my country, Poland, we also have gener general conscription in if it's wartime. If it's if the shits go down, we're going to the army. Yup, and it kind of works like that, from what I remember. Well, tough luck, my man. Tough, tough luck. Hmm. I mean, if you kind of, oh, no, I don't even, I won't even start this. <laughs> Good that you're saying it straight to his face. He didn't even start it. He even didn't even start in the army, and you're talking about a sacrifice. So, you know. And discipline, yeah, well, they were common people, they weren't used to the army regimen. Well, that's not a great perspective to have. Eight weeks of military training. Dang. So they are cannon fodder. Or door stoppers. Yeah, they are. Dang it. Hanson doesn't have the best of luck. Ooh. Dang it. So that's Sanson. At least it looks like it. Yep. War bodies. It seems... It's actually... Most of the antagonists in this DLC met at the war, didn't they? Ben? Hanson? Sanson? Um... I wonder about the clowns and skulls themselves. Are they post-war army men? Or Templar? Some of them at least. Hmm. Can't be sure for a fact. Maybe some of them are. Yeah, well. See? Just put up with it. No, man. No. Ah. You know what? Hanson is straight up badass here. Hanson is a badass. Not only, not only is he a great boss, even though his people are of a questionable nature and intelligence from what we've seen from the dialogue, he himself strives to be the best. He even pays them for overtime and for additional weird things like they went to the tram and shop to boost morale, etc. And he's a wartime hero. Well, quote-unquote hero, because I... Because we can't say for sure he didn't do anything bad. He's just following orders, definitely. Yep. See? He's even fulfilling the order of his dead commander. Dang. Oh, interesting. Huh. You you were in a bad situation if you're doing that kind of stuff. Yeah, well, 
Color me surprised. Hmm. Hanged crown. Hanged crown, hanged crown. Ben's unit or if I'm remembering it right? Yeah, it seems to be Ben's unit. Yeah, of course they couldn't afford to do that. Actually, why would they want to? They bought them time to rearrange their own army to resupply, the su the restock the supply lines, to, you know, patch up the soldiers. I mean, that's... why would you want to sanction them? It was against the orders. They did was not were not given the order for guerrilla warfare, but hmm. Okay. That ain't bad. It doesn't seem bad at least. <laughs> yeah, he would be, cause the first in the first place, you basically are certain to die. Because, but in the second, there is actually a decent degree of survivability, you know. Wonder, seems like he was shot in the leg. Well, he's bleeding from everywhere, so maybe shrapnel or something. I don't know. Oh, so they did. So, after that one year of failures and three, three years after, so it lasted four years at, at, in the very least, not counting the first years when only the aristocracy fought. Hmm. I don't blame the man. A little case of PTSD or what? Private military company. So not being a farmer anymore. Change the uniform for a suit. He looks great with those kinda longer hair and that unkempt hairdo. He actually it actually suits him. He actually suits him. Hmm. Post-war recovery, you say? Hmm. So, it, the security company didn't yield enough money, so you changed it into a private crime business, it seems. But why? Why on earth did you name them Drifter Clowns? Why did you use the clowns? Ugh. <sighs> So yeah, I was actually right speculating that that they should be post mercenaries, post war veterans, some of them at least. Yeah, yeah, checks out. I don't know if a white suit is great for this job, but that's not much. And what should you be aiming for? Oh. Okay, interesting. That actually sounds like a very proper managed company. Odd, but okay. I mean, changes are not always bad. You had to wear that clown mask as well? 
I actually am interested in why. Why the clown mask? I mean, I know that, yeah, this part, but why exactly a clown? Hmm. Well, and he went and became a manager. Hmm, Way was also from the start, it seems. Well, not much. Just got to work your ass off. Yep. Anything you can you can view it like this. It can be a challenge in life. Hmm. I don't know, man. It doesn't seem like it's getting to him, at least at the start. It will grow on ya. It will grow on ya. Those are some savvy suits, you know? They don't look bad. But you actually only targeted criminals at the start. That's interesting. Criminal with a bag of money, you say. Mainly. Mainly. So not only against criminals. To loot the wealth, you say. Well, thieving does that to you, I guess. Got a lot of opportunities to train running, I guess. So you're not using guns in this time. Hmm. Avoided getting civilians getting caught in their activities in order to minimize conflict. Basically, they avoided a situation where civilians could get caught in their activities. Would be, I think it would be a better way to say that, but same shtick. That changed. I mean, I wonder what happened that it changed that much. Well, yeah, get the money. Hmm. So that's executives in the making. Even Way can't catch up. I mean, Way's mask is kind of sad now. Oh. Interesting. So Sanson was the first to get manager position. Way kind of held the grudge for a moment, it seems. Hmm. So it's basically the same period of time. Really? Do you guys really look like that without the masks? It's kind of hilarious that you do, you know? <laughs> Is that mandatory part of the dress code that you need to be bold and chubby as well? Because he is... You know, he isn't bold, but he's a bit chubby. Don't like the hairdo, Hanson. Don't like the hairdo. You look better in that unkempt style. Then you also have named employees. Ah, <laughs> that's kind of sweet from them. Assistant manager, Sancho. Yeah, that cake, that cake looks heavy. Head of the department. Yeah, you can be proud that you're in this sort of a organization and why is where are you holding the ceremony because it kind of doesn't look like a great place but it's not the place that makes the ceremony it's the people as they say Ooh, so those are the shoes that we looted from him 
we also took Wei's shoes, so we're kind of we're kind of brutal here, you know. We took the shoes that he got from when he got his promotion. Dang, man, that's gonna hurt. That that's gonna be that's gonna be devastating, and you know, and that's some psychological warfare we're doing. You know. But that's good, that's good that he is... He's trying and they're trying, you know? Even though they're kinda criminal. Ah. Good that they know about it. Yeah. But they tried, at least. They did. Hmm. Yeah, you guys look like eating is most of the things you do. I think he actually should. Yeah, that's a nice gesture. Oh, come on, come on. You kind of look weird going in a group of chubby, bold people all dressed in suits. But that's just me. I would, I would kind of, that would kind of be disturbing if I saw that from my home. Hmm. You know, retirement isn't a bad option, Hanson. You can't do this shtick for your whole life. Come on, man. You cannot. Yeah, didn't work like that, did it? So that was a good hunch that Alyssa has. I mean, it was experience, speaking from Alyssa's point of view. That's why she pressed Bianca to do this. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, maybe he's just ha she just has a big mouth and deep down inside he's all, you know, Hanson's best buddy. Hmm. See? See? Hanson. Hanson's a good man. Well, I mean... Hard to say he's a good man, but he's a proper manager, definitely. Hmm. Oh, that... that's kinda... Yeah, I get that, I get that. Yeah, it's it's this 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 moment. It's this moment when he kinda analyzes everything and I should have done this or that. Well you can call Sanson. Hmm. Oh man. You should. You should. But not through the phone. If you can you you should do it personally. After all those years. Oh well, look at the time. We got people to beat up. It's not. It's a nice task for a lost task. You can... High degree of completing it successfully. Police car, you say? Can you? So, just drive naturally and we'll hand it. Hand, hand it? We'll take care of it when we get to the destination, I guess. Yep. Who are you talking to? Mark, you say. Mark kind of came out of the blue, you know. He was in the previous mission with the... Um, the ambush against Bianca and Alyssa, I think. And now he's kind of here. Because they needed an, another elite unit. Hmm. Hmm. 
Yeah, that seems fishy. I mean, that is an idea. But this is a fact. Okay, that's kind of brutal, but that's an option. So what's your plan here, Hansen? Okay, so those are the mercenaries you were outsourcing, I guess. You're not gonna tell us the plan, are you, Hansen? You shoot down three of his propositions, but you didn't say anything else. You only said it's an ambush. Yeah, they did. I mean, experiences, speaking through them. That sounded like an explosion. I think it was. What happened to Albus? Nothing. That's great. So what are we looking at here? Ruins. Does not seem like the last mission. I was expecting the base to be the last mission, but we'll see. It may very well be that level 54 extremely violent case was in an underground base. So... Hmm. That's a, that, that's a good action to take. How did you... How could you not consider this, actually, if you're attacking an enemy fortified position? I bike run... Hmm. It's a long time since we saw a bike run. <coughs> those are those first and pesky combat robots. Yeah, 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 we get it, we get it. But when it comes to bike runs, we need to shred the armor first. Actually, I'll, yeah, Alyssa and Albus have armor-breaking capabilities. Now you guys, what are you guys going up to? Okay. That, that would be my plan as well. And then join up in one group and tackle the remnants. If we can do it, that is, that is. I don't know if you can take care of them yourself, but... Okay, so... Seems everything is set properly. How... let's... let's get some scouting here. Not that far away from each other. Whoa, this is a large map. And we don't have our backs to the zone wall, as we can see. It's quite a way away to the zone wall. This is... Hmm. We are attacking the enemy base. They were talking like it was one of the last missions, if not the last mission. And we have 46 enemies. Yet, in the park, we had 55. And we're scattered. Who plans these missions, man? Who plans these missions? Okay, here's the zone wall. I'm gonna do some scouting through the fog of war to see where the wall is and where our various um, terrain obstructions and points of interest. Um, that I like to do that before a mission. Okay, so we're basically kind of near the center, to be honest. Hmm. We have some... the transports are here. They said that the, they, they see a bike run, so I'm expecting the bike runs to be somewhere here near the transport. How are we doing with the time? Let me see. 34 minutes. We can do a turn. Um, I will, would like to use... I would like to use the bushes, I think. And see what we can... No? No one? Okay. Um, that's odd. Hmm. Actually here. 
because we have cover from here. Interesting, so nothing here. Did not expect that. Could go here, but I don't want to uncover that um, wide of an area. I want to go tall, then I'll go wide. I think that's the better idea. That way we won't um, stretch our forces like that. Okay, snipers. So that's a thing. Hmm. Can we? No, we cannot. But he's moving again quite quickly, so... That won't be a problem. Dusk Ranger, you say. This is with the increased hit chance. Well, it's more than a coin toss, so let's try. And we did it. I'm expecting a first group to be here, concentrated on... I was gonna say, it kind of should look like Hanson would be there, but... And indeed he was. Let me see, can I... He is standing in the bushes, but so will I. Basically, we're standing here to just counter him. And there's the Bicron that we saw. Now... Now this whole shtick. This could prove a problem. This could prove to be a problem. But luckily, you know, first, yeah, first thing, Mimic Beacon. That's the first thing I would like to do. The second thing is, I would like to summon Simon, my fire drone, because I built him to... Oh, that's a different bike drone. Oh, that hurts. I built him to have uh, armor disabled. That's nasty. That's nasty as heck. That was not a good first turn. Could have did done that a bit better, right? Oh god dang it, Mark. Really? Really? Was that a headshot, or what was that? Because you were tanking it like a boss and suddenly you died. Seems like a headshot. Okay, I think this is... this is gonna... This is gonna take a redo. Unfortunately. Did you? Yeah, you did kill one guy. Even have revenge shots. Dang it. Interesting. But now... Now, honestly, it would be better to do this. It would be better to do this. Where can I... No. Here. Further away. Fortunately, Ray is getting hit. We want Ray to actually try and at least take care of someone. And that someone would be those two. Probably won't be the case since you have a lot of hit points. Really, you dodged and revenge shot me. Those are the bots, the new bots, that I was talking about. 
they do pack a punch. They do pack a punch, not, not gonna lie, they are pretty nasty. Um, not something I wanted to face right now when we had have a ridiculous amount of Bicrons and a Freezing Cron. Um, go, go, go. Well, might as well try it. It should bounce to those guys. Great. Honestly, the lightning won't do much to the Bicrons, so... So that's a thing. She doesn't have a revive like Albus does. Though Albus won't be in a very hot position himself when he runs into those guys. Even though the armor break is... Well... This one. That's something weird. I don't know if I like that one. I don't know if I like that one. Okay, let's see. We gotta get rid of Mark. That is something weird. Need to ch check that. Because I shot him at least two times and he didn't get damage from any of those shots, so... What do you have, Mark? Conceal is one thing. Okay. So I can't get info on you. Okay. So be it. So be it. Honestly, let's go full offense. May not be a good idea. And... Maybe, maybe, maybe we should do this as well. Because we have some mages here and we have a healer here, so... I don't want you guys to get killed right out of the bat. Same goes for you guys. Since... Since they are shooting us, it would be a good idea to... It would be a good idea to actually have some defense. Characters that can revive and and or have decent block or avoidance can go forward. Yeah, I forgot they had that. Oh, that's a lot of in there. That is a lot of in there. Need to say that. Now, this will get kind of funky. Not gonna lie, this will get kind of funky. So. A couple of things. First thing, first thing. First thing. These should be placed. Second thing. Um can you? Yes you can. Awaken on Ray. Don't want you to stand here at the front. Let's go back even a little. Even if a little, I want you to stand back. I could hit. Could hit if I use this. Do I want to hit? Will this be something I want? If I hit him, he should go back, so... But Ray is damaged, so I actually want to heal myself. Just in case. Not fully trusting the magic smoke cloud. Because the dodges always run out when I needed them the most, so yeah. This is not a full on trust mechanism. You. First off, we're changing to defensive stance. And then throw the bastard. Dodged. Well, one dodged, but we took care of one and damaged the other. So it's not that all that bad. 54. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. 
Now the enemy moves in a large batch, so this could be a problem. Strange, but okay. You guys will probably die quite quickly, the officers. Dang it. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Problem is... Problem is... Leeton would be needed right now. Maybe it was a mistake to go after Hanson that aggressively. Because I could have used him right now. To block the bot at least. Very, very least to block the bot. Hmm. Dang it, we ran out of the smoke to be... To be, st to be standing here, that's bad. I'm not gonna do anything about it now. Yeah, these guys. These guys are nasty. Really nasty. And unfortunately, Anne was in that shitty place. Those guys are... Destrons. Those guys are nasty as heck. I can actually... Cannot show you that, but... I could view it in my... Side mission. They have... High amounts of HP, ridiculous amounts of armor. So, things are kinda bad. Hmm. Yeah, things are kinda bad. That's why I said that I don't know if we'll be doing this. Well, this is a... Basically near... We're far in... With this mission. It's one of the last ones, probably, judging from the story. And we're going in blind, so I was expecting at least one or two... Retries. So yeah. If we... Our situation is not looking that fine and dandy. Um... This side not so much. This side is looking bad. We should... If I'm, if I'm going to retry this, we'll actually go on one side. But for now, we're still hanging on. So, I think we're gonna make a cut here. So, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Take care. Cześć!